so this was all the rubbish that was left over from doing our little test panels and blocks and clay rolls. So it's a mixture of pampas and rapo and uh, rank roadside grass and wood shavings and uh, vetiver grass. Everything's in there. Just uh, we'll have an experimental, make an experimental uh, test panel with this uh, just to tidy up the place. Okay, this is all the rubbish that was left over from doing our test panels and blocks and bricks and um, we just had to tidy up the place and so um, everything was on the ground was scraped together and there's raupa and cutty grass and uh, wood shavings and bed of the grass and uh, Vassy grass, which is that rank paspellum that grows on the side of the road, and uh, so it really, uh, you know, even though it looks pretty rough, you know, it's a real shaggy dog uh, type of uh, wool, but um, you know, this one shaped up nicely after we um, uh, put our um, our fibered clay plaster. That's a brown coat. We're just covering up the. Um, the humps and hollows uh, and getting a uh, reasonable uh, level surface uh, on your wall that's called a, a brown coat uh, so this is this first surface is a scratch coat the, it's the um, you know reveals the, the contour of the wall that you have to work with and so um, you know even even a wall like this is going to scrub up we're going to put our clay slurry and uh, uh, chopped vetiver. Uh, well, first our primer is to just do a um, a, uh, a kind of a clay, um, a, a just pure clay plaster um, with no no sand, no chopped fibre, and then um, that that creates the a uh, 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 bonding surface for our fibred clay. You know that's uh, a term uh, people are going to have to. Um, get used to uh, fibred clay that's um, just a step up from light earth light earth being very very low clay content and very high fiber content uh, but um, with fibred clay you're really looking at um, um, much higher volume of clay compared to fiber and then, then of course there's finishing plasters which um, is where we really get fussy and uh, get a perfectly smooth level surface so that water resistant uh, that's a critical thing keep the water out water is the enemy